I have told you countless times. To stop bothering yourself about this. It's not going to do you any good but cause you pains, make you sad. Am I supposed to be happy? No, babies, tell me, am I supposed to be laughing? Uh -huh. What about? Hey, hey come on. Everything will be fine, okay? Mm. You have to trust me and believe in God, okay? Children will come and everything will be fine. So in the meantime, you have to drink and eat. You, this has badly affected your appetite lately. Hmm? I still don't get how you are always so calm and collected. Even when the storm is raging, you're still so calm. I mean, we've been married for years. And that was. Look at me. That is because there is time, okay? And children will come. All you need to do is be happy because we have a very beautiful life ahead of us. So we can't continue to live our lives in sorrow, expecting something that God has already put in store for us. Hmm? smile. No, no, not this one. The other one. <laughs> that made me fall in love with you. <laughs> <laughs> it's enough, Maria. Enough! Please! Please, babe. Let's talk about this. Uh, please. It hurts. L like it's the only thing we're ever going to talk about. Give it a break, honey. We've got our lives to live, and I've got work to go to. Jack, we have a problem. Don't make it look like it's not that serious. And you're being serious right now? No, you're being serious? You want me to leave work and start discussing baby making with you now? Goodness. This is my problem too, you know. So please, stop. For the very last time, stop. Jack. Jack! I saw the drugs, Maria. You got new ones even when I asked you not to. Those are from the hospital. And so were the bottles before these ones. Jack. Don't, don't even jack me. Don't. Is, is it that you're not configured to obey instructions or what? For God's sake, you have not even gone for a checkup yet. And then you take drugs upon drugs? Do you know the risk you're putting your system through? Do you want to put me into trouble? Jack, I'm not planning to put you into any sort of trouble. Then let's go for one. Maybe we will get to know what's wrong. See, the drugs are too much. Look, I'm the man here, you know. But I'm not even putting you through any form of stress. I'm not putting you through pressure. You do not want to start battling high blood pressure at this stage, do you? Look, you need some rest. Just go to bed. Go to bed. 
Rest, Maria. <sighs> when you crave for something so desperately, you can do almost everything. You will lie in the process, cheat in the process, deceive in the process to achieve it. You will endanger your life. What you want, oh, in your best to get what you want, you may end up losing, losing what you've been trying to protect, yeah. and what you're trying to get, trying to protect, you may end up losing, losing what you've been trying losing. to protect, and what oh. you're trying. supposed to be eating together. What's the matter? Well, I've had mine. Uh, babes, it's nothing serious. I'll be back soon, okay? B babes, I'll see you soon. <laughs> Bing! Maria! Oh. Okay. Madam, what have you done to your womb? What do you mean, doctor? Is there any problem? What's wrong with me? Well, have you done an abortion before? Jesus Christ. Abortion? Yes. No. Um, is there any problem, doctor? Is the fault from me? From the test conducted on you, we find out your womb has been damaged. Wait. You can never have a child. What? That's impossible. Well, if you said you've not done an abortion before, so what's happened? Is there something you'd like to discuss with me? Just think. There is, there is uh, one more thing. Uh, actually, um, uh, uh, hello, Zoe. I need to talk to you. No, 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 no. Right now, like I need to talk to you now. Yes, no, not in the evening, Zoe. Now. Okay. Zoe, I, I know it was a stupid thing to do. Trust me. At that time, I didn't know it would even matter. You were sorry, mother. You gave them the baby and then took the money. Stop making this surrogate sound as if it's a very bad thing. I mean, people do this all the time. I was 23 at that time. I needed that money. 
I had to finish my school. I had nobody. For Christ's sake, you were operated upon. How couldn't you have noticed? How? Jesus Christ. Jack needs to know about this. He really needs to know about this. If truly you operated upon and your womb got damaged in the process, this is something he needs to know. Your husband needs to know about it. Can you even tell me that? No! I have a child. That child is still with that family. All I need to do is find them, get my child. It's that simple. Oh my God. I don't think you know what you're doing. You really don't know what you're doing. How? How can you do that? This is so delicious. By the way, I got a new office today. Mm. You know, after my promotion, they couldn't move me out of the previous one. Mm. So, as soon as I got to work today, they handed over the keys to my new office. It's in the new West building. Hmm. Top floor and um, uh, in a separate elevator. Quite thin. Hmm. Is that all you say? You're not even excited? Like you're not happy for me? What? Oh my god, babes. I'm I'm so happy for you. Hey. <laughs> Congratulations, baby. I'm so happy for you. Oh babe, when does it happen? You sound uh, fake to me, my darling wife. Like, were you even listening to me? Did mm -hmm. you hear a thing of what I just said? Mm-hmm. Okay, fine. Now, what was it I just said? Um, but uh, I just said congratulations, husband man. No. I need you to say a thing of what I just said to at least prove that you've been listening to me. Um, um. Are you for real? Goodness. Um, um, babes. I said congratulations. Uh, um. Honey. God. What is going on? Since you got back today, you have been moody and you keep zoning off. Nothing, I am. You what? You're fine? We don't lie to ourselves, remember? Right? So, what is the matter? Baby, 
It's nothing. I'm actually... <laughs> what have you been thinking about? Us. Um, well, I mean... I... I read something to... I mean, I read something earlier today and it's been bothering me. I can't seem to take it off my mind. So, I... I... What was it about? You know you can save us some peace by going straight to the point. Babes, what if you find out about something really bad I I was um, supposed to tell you and and didn't tell you? Um, what if um, this piece of information actually pisses you off? And you're so angry that you might even decide to throw me out. What, what if I... Am? Come here. There'll be no such what ifs, okay? I can swear on the altar of our love. Hmm?
Maria, a lot of people all over the continent use that app. I'll be so disappointed in you if you think there is a chance at finding them. At least I should have seen a figment of them or something. I have searched, searched, nothing. If you need something to do, searching for them is a waste of time. Talk to your husband. He will understand. No. I can't. I have said no. What do you think he would do? Give me a hug? Applaud me? Do you know I have never told Jack about this before? So I won't. So what's your plan? Let's say you find this family. Maria, this is over 10 years. And you think they will just hand over the child to you? Come on! I gave birth to this child. I even lost my womb in the process. That should at least mean something to them, right? Maria, Jack needs to know. Whether you like it or not, he's your husband. He has the right to know. No, okay? No. <sighs> I need to find this child first. But until then, Jack knows nothing. But that's not even why I called you. I need a favor. Yes, this is Mrs. Maria speaking. I asked for a private investigator and Zoe recommended you. Said you're very good. Yes, there is someone I want you to help me find. Actually, a family. I will send you their details, yes. How long will that take? Oh no, that's so much time and time is what I don't have. Okay, okay it's fine. I'll wait, thank you so much. Okay. What's going on? <laughs> Nothing, babes. I was just talking to Zoe and... Are you sure you're okay? Yes, I'm But I'm fine. I'm good. <laughs> Let's go. Hello? Um, no, please. Um, make it 30. Yes, 8.30 a.m. Oh, no, I, I won't be a minute late. Thank you. Okay, see you. Daughter of um, Alice and Robert. 
they haven't aged a bit. Just the way I remember them. Well, about um, Joy, tell me about her. She's 12 and the only daughter of the couples. Okay. Um, do you have an address, school, office, where I can trace them to? Well, um, in there you will find more and more pictures of them. They live a pretty normal life. They leave home between 7.30 in the morning till 9 a.m. and okay. come back around 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. Okay. Um, well, is there an address, office, shop, where I can actually trace them to? Yeah. In there you will find more and more pictures and addresses. All right. All right. Thank you so much for a job well done. Thank you. I'll get to see you. I don't really know what you're looking for, but I think it seems very, very important. Very important. What? Uh, thank you. All okay. the same. I wish you good luck. Uh, thank you. Take care. Joking? I am here for my child. Why do you both look horrified? Well, I want to see her. I want my child back. Are you out of your freaking mind? Our business ended 12 years ago when we sealed that deal. My womb got destroyed. She belongs to me and... And, and what, my what? You think you can just come 12 years later and knock on my door? Lay claims? So you think we'll just stand up and give you a standing ovation and hand over the child to you because she's a parcel? Huh? I gave birth to her. And we paid you for that. You cashed out 1.5 million naira. Or have you forgotten the part that you signed that you will never disturb us again? You will never come back to us again because you needed that money for your for 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 your, for, for, for your education. Get out! Get out of my house! Right this minute! Get out! 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 Get out! Go! 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 Never! <sighs> Take it is. Oh no, oh no. They threw me out of your house just. just like that. <laughs> oh my god, Maria, you make me laugh. Eh? What were you expecting? A hug? Or a clap? Or maybe they should have given you flowers? Why is it that? Nobody is seeing this from my own point of view. Why is no one seeing it? For Christ's sake, Zoe, this is my only child. And I want her back. I want her back. Maria, listen to me. That child is not yours. Okay? You only carried out a service which you were paid for. For Christ's sake! Collected money. Girl, you are off the hook. 
If you ask me, you have options. Her name is Joy. Zoe, that is my first and only fruit. Do you expect me to let this child go just like that? I Zoe. Zoe, I love my husband. You know I love Jack with all of me, Zoe. Zoe, I need this child back to tell Jack I am a fruitful woman. I need this child back. I need to get Joy back. I need this child back. I need my child back. Back, Zoe. I need my child back. not getting to you. I mean, how can you show up after so many years from nowhere and, and, and lay such wild claims? See, listen, Joy is our daughter and nothing is going to change that. Hmm? Maria was paid for the job. She was paid handsomely and she signed an agreement. An agreement is an agreement. She sent me a message that um, she would like us to see tomorrow. Robert, I have a hunch that this is the beginning of big trouble. But certainly not for us. Hmm? She has no claims. She does not have it. That, that's the entire truth. So just, just rest. Tomorrow you can go and see her and hear what she has to say. Robert, I'm hmm. sure it's not something good. I bet you it's not. Mm. But she cannot win. I'm sure about it. <sighs> the lie you've been telling me for a while now. Look at you. You're emaciated and barely yourself and you say you're fine. You're crying. <laughs> Ever since you got back from wherever it was you went to and whoever it was you saw, you stopped being the woman I fell in love with. You stopped being the woman I married. What is going on? Babes, what if this isn't delay, but just total denial? What? Jax, what if? We can never have kids. What if I can't bear you, children? 
Would you still love me? Don't tell me. Will you still look at me the same way you look at me? Talk to me. See. Hey. You. 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 Come on. This is too much. Talk to me, Jack. Still love me? Or would you keep telling yourself this lie you've told yourself over time that you wouldn't care? Babes, talk. No, talk to me! <sighs> of course. What was I thinking? What was I even thinking? Of course you would care. Of course you would care. <laughs> Maria! I'm sure you didn't invite me here so we could breed at each other. I wanted to talk. About what? Please don't just say any nonsense here. Because I, I am a very busy woman. What is it you want to talk about? want more money. That's fine. But listen, I will give you more money. But, Maria, you have to stay the hell away from my family. Please, stay away from my family, oh. Stay away from my family. Alice, I want my child back and nothing else. I'm very sure you are ready to protect your own family with everything. Trust me, I'm ready to do the same. Give me my child back, that's all. Listen and listen, good young lady. We had an agreement, we had a deal. We kept to ours, keep to yours. Stay the hell away from my family. You do not have any child with me. It's just yes. my child. I carry okay. that child in my room for nine months. Give me my child, is that so much to ask? Jesus! People are so selfish. I want my child, that's all. Hey, honey. What's wrong? Babes, what, what's going on? I booked an appointment with a friend today. You, you did what? Isn't that what you wanted? To know exactly what is wrong with us? So I can at least have my once happy wife back. Who said anything was wrong with us, babes? I don't understand. Why? Why? And what do you want? I don't even know you anymore. You're hardly here with me, and when you're here, you don't even speak. It is obvious something is eating you up. 
And your suspense, your silence is beginning to eat me up too. So I better talk about it right now, once and for all. Well, I don't want to. Trust me, you don't, you don't even understand what's going on, babes. Then, just, just... Then make me understand. We haven't even checked ourselves up medically, you know. Right? Let me handle this. Let me fix it. Please, just let me handle this. And what do you mean by, I can handle this? Like your God who gives children? Babes, look at me. Look, look, we haven't really checked ourselves medically. So, it's not a bad idea. Babes, look at me. Please, trust me. I am working on this, please. And you have been working on this for ages now. And yet, we're like this. We live like strangers in this house. And you're working on it. I should trust you. Something so badly, you can do almost anything. When you crave for something so desperately, you can do almost everything. You will lie in the process, cheat in the process, deceive in the process to achieve it. You'll endanger your life and all this Just to get what you want oh. Go easy, take it easy Cause in your quest to get what you want You may end up losing what you want job for you. Yes, yes, yes. Um, I'll send you the address, okay? All right. Good night. Trying to protect you may end up losing what you've been trying to protect. And what you're trying to get. Do you understand the joke? Apply for the place of a maid. Win the night and bring their child to you. Is that it? Of course. But you need to at least look decent. If you can't, just pretend to be. You know? I... I got you some stuff to make you look really professional. The more professional you look. A professional maid? Mm -hmm. Me? The more professional you look, the better chance you stand at getting the job. It will save you out from the rest. <sighs> well, I transferred half of the money. You'll get a balance when the job is done and when I have my child. Get it? 
Okay. Uh, and don't forget, remember your previous place of work. I've sent you the address. Please apply today, Ruth. You need to apply today. Okay. Let me go change into this. That's fine. A professional man. It's amazing how some people So, what's your name and how did you get to know about those records? Ruth, my name is Ruth. I saw the vacancy earlier today. So, I went home to prepare and came back. So where have you worked previously? Uh, is this the first time you will be managing a home? No, this is not my first time, sir. I worked with one Mr. Bright, but the man died. Ah. Then I now worked with one of the Deji family, but those ones too, they moved out of the country. So I moved on. Mm. 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 And I'd worked as a nanny before. So if you have children, it is to you people's advantage. Um, Ruth, Ruth, you are the fourth person that will be asking after this job in the first five hours. But you impress me. So my wife will give you a rundown to how this house works. Congratulations. Congratulations. Yeah. Okay, yeah. after me. I'll be right back then. something for you. Do you like spaghetti? Yes. I'll make some for you. But you go upstairs first, change your clothes, come downstairs, and I'll prepare it for you. This will be so easy. No, Joy, Joy, you have to eat this food now. Martina, let me finish my cartoon first. Baby girl, not today. This food first. Open your mouth. That's my baby girl. You know I love you. Open. <laughs> <laughs> Open your mouth. <laughs> Open. Open. Okay. Can I have that? Mm. <laughs> a baby. Do you like the food? Okay, delicious, right? Good. But next time, like I said, take your food to the dining to eat, not here. Mm. And you finish your food first before cutting. Open your mouth. That's my girl. Can I <laughs> Open your mouth. <laughs> Naughty girl. Ooh. Okay. Hmm. Come on. Cartoon can oh. wait. Oh, that girl so good. <laughs> As in, the way Joy just warmed up to her is amazing. You know, Joy never warms up to anybody. Exactly what I'm saying. 
As in, she's so good, she treats joy like her own. Most of the time when she does, she doesn't even know that I'm watching. So we made the right choice, huh? Yes. We did. So just look at you. Huh? You look brighter and stronger. Like that old commercial, you look colorful and brighter. <laughs> <laughs> huh? If you see her taking her in her assignments mm. and homework, it's so heartwarming. Mm. And they bond so fast. I'm so happy. I'm so happy I brought her in. You know what? Yeah. I am happy. Something I'll call you. It's dangerous you calling me. It's dangerous. Kappa. Well, beautifully, she has actually started warming up to me. When I talked her into bed today, she wouldn't let go of my hand. Oh, Maria, I have some suggestions. But just relax. Like I said, when it's time, I'll let you know. You know, I just got here. How are you? I'm fine, ma. Are you okay? Yes, 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 ma, I am. I was on the phone with my mom. And you just actually startled me. Oh, sorry about that. I was actually coming to say thank you to you um, for everything you did. And also to thank you for helping me talk joy. Thank you, man. I really appreciate you. Thank you, man. All right. Thank you, man. Thank you, Jeez. Listen, uh, anytime you see 
her, just scream for help. And you never step out of his house without any of us, most especially Ruth. Ruth is the only person you can trust. She's part of us now. Please, don't talk to anybody, any stranger again. Please. And she said... It's nothing she says is relevant. Hmm? Listen to your mother. Maria is a dangerous woman. Don't ever let her come close to you. Hmm? For your own good. Now, rush after you. There she. she crossed the line. She crossed the line. I'm thinking we might have to involve the police in this. Yeah, I'm thinking same too. Thankfully, I still have her documents she signed 12 years ago intact. Her signature and even the date. Yeah. We have to do something. Because if she had the guts to go to joy, who knows what lengths she can get to. Well, you just get the papers ready. We'll give her a little time. But if this madness does not wane, we involve the police. <sighs> oh. I think I need a choice. For the first time in a long while, you have to redeem yourself in bed. Mm. Yeah, thank you. Thank you for bringing my wife back. Mm. Wow. Mm. Have a good night. I'm sorry. Um, there is something I want to do. Oh, not again. Not again, my darling. Okay. It's like a survey. God forbid. Mm -hmm. God forbid. But let's, 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 let's just see it happen. What did you do? It's a family. Well, a wife of mine should know that I do not like secrets. And if this secret we're talking about is capable of rocking and cracking my marriage, then she should have told me. But if she fails to tell me and I find out, it means that she never even loved or respected me in the first place. Um, um, are, are, are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. But I just, I'm just trying to like, you know, it, it's a survey. So I want to know what you would do if this woman, uh, the damage is like damaged womb, damaged liver, something really bad, like she's really damaged. Babe, tell me what would you do? You, like, you, you get me scared, honestly. You sure you're okay? Mm -hmm. Um. You want a real, honest answer to this question? Ma, you settled me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Ma. I didn't mean to scare you, Ma. Yeah, thank you. But, Ma, I never meant to eavesdrop on a conversation, but I heard everything that happened. 
and I said, she's trying to take my joy. She's trying to take my child. It's okay, ma. You are, you're a mother and I know you love her so much. The truth is, nobody can take your joy away from you. She's your child. She's your child. You just have to fight for her. You have to fight for her, ma. Hello? Let's play it your way. Same place, same time. See you there. Oh, thank you. Where have you been all my life? Thank you so much. You're welcome. Where is she? Um, upstairs, ma'am. is a copy of the contract you signed 12 years ago. So I have you know that what you are doing now is a breach of contract, which is criminal in the court of law. This means nothing. Absolutely nothing. Listen, you do not care about her. It's just because you cannot have kids of your own. That is why you are clamoring to have her. Listen, surrogacy is a beautiful thing for women like us that cannot have children of our own. If you get what I mean. That child was made for my egg and Robert's spare. If there is anyone I am supposed to drag that child with, it's Robert, not even me. Does your husband know about this? I bet he doesn't. Because <laughs> what husband would allow his wife to be doing all this? Obviously not. I'm sure he doesn't even know that you have damaged womb as well. Listen, young lady, let me advise you. I would have you know that you go have a personal chat with your husband. Get things sorted out. Because guess what? My family does not have anything to offer you other than trouble. I bet you. How much do you want? Three million? <laughs> Five million? Ten million? Just name it. Any price I'll pay. Trust me, I will even compensate you. But give me my chapter back. Maria, you fail to understand something. You are not called a mother because a child passes through your vessel. There's more to being a mother. You feel the pain of your child. The child feels loved, cared for in all ramification. You feel her pulse, her pains, her joys. Her everything. Guess what? You are never going to be Joy's mother. You are not her mother. You can never be her mother. Listen to me. Stay away from mine. If I see you close to mine, you have the police, my lawyers, and 
guess what? This is not chess game. I met with the doctor today, and I booked an appointment for five this time. But I, I already said I am handling this. Mm. Babe, why are you speeding things? I don't understand, look, why? I, I, look, I, I've been thinking. I've been thinking about our discussion, I mean, the discussion we had last night. I... Why don't we just work things out? What if I've been selfish all this while, knowing that all you've ever wanted is a child? But I already... Uh, I said it's... <laughs> easy, easy. I had a deep thought about the question you asked. If it truly matters that we do not have a child of our own. I, I can't lie to myself, Maria. It truly does matter. Well, you can count on me. You can count on our love. Okay? I will never, never, ever stop loving you. All right? Yeah. Where did you smile from me?
Jesus, we do the one. My husband said he booked an appointment. Okay, for next week. Please, I need a huge friend. Oh, of course it comes with a pay. Yes, come in. Thank you very much, ma. You deserve more. One other thing. Switched off. Why? Why? Why tonight? Why tonight, my dear? Oh, oh yes, uh, Mr. Jack. I think um, your test result uh, came out a few minutes ago. Oh, oh, yes, I think great. you should uh, take a look at it and. Uh, 
That is your result. Is this serious? What? Babe, what's wrong? Is, is, is there a problem? Just look at it. He can't be serious. No. Nothing is wrong with us, my darling. My goodness! I was beginning to doubt myself, you know. I, I, I thought I was the problem. Come, come, feel my heartbeat. As if a very heavy load left my chest. Me too, baby. As you, can, you are fine. as you can see, you and your wife are perfectly okay. Thank God. Yes, you're perfectly okay. Thank Medically, God. you're fine. Wow. Okay, now that it's been confirmed that we're perfectly fine, um, I, I think we need to be patient and try other options, safe options. Um, right. I would advise um, for now to keep your house busy. You can adopt. I'm talking okay. about Sarah. Uh, 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 doctor. Let, let me speak. No, no, it's fine. We will wait on the Lord, baby. Yeah, okay. we will. The fine doctor, thank you You're so much. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you very much, doctor. Well, thank you very much, doctor. You're welcome. Thank you, You're thank welcome. doctor. Thank, thank you, you so welcome. much, doctor. Thank You're you. Uh, wow. Let me, let me think. Thank you, doctor. You're welcome. You're welcome. I need my child before all this blows up. Oh, thank you so much, You're Doctor. Welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> okay. Hey, honey. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll do it. I will do it. Yeah, I'll do it. Okay. okay. Yeah, it's a special day. Mm -hmm. oh. mm -hmm. uh, how do you do that, man? <laughs> oh, I'll do it. I'll ah, do it. <laughs> see, see, <laughs> oh, see how you disguise yourself. See. <laughs> <laughs> See ya! Oh, I told you. I can't do it. I can't do it. Mm. 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 Okay, uh, that's it now. Uh, <laughs> you know that's not it. That's not it. What is this? What's up? This still works? Of course. Why would your first gift to me on our anniversary not work? Mm. My first gift? Yes. <laughs> you know. Today means a lot to me, and I'm happy you came up with this. Come on, look at you. You deserve it. Hmm? You have been battling with a mad woman for weeks, and then you stood up to her and told her. And now we are having the best six days of our lives in a long while. I know. You truly deserve it. You didn't take so many pictures today, just as we used to take it when we first got married, then. Thank you so much. Do whatever you think fit, as long as it makes you smile down. Okay? Thank you, baby. Take it here. I love you. Now you should go back. <laughs> and let's go. <laughs> let's go, let's go, let's go. Can't wait.
stupid girl. Wait for your call, my food. You want me to return, but you please me. Is that okay? So, I'm going to What? Yes! Oh, oh. We have to go back. Oh. So. I, I, I want you. I want you. I'm sorry now. I'm sorry. We're not far from the house now. So we can easily still pick it up. And what if we were far from the house? What would you have done? I bet go job. Is that what you would say? Far I said, from the house. Sorry. Oh, you're yeah, sorry. Shall let's go. I need the camera. I'm so beautiful. You! <laughs> you have a camera on a special day! Like this. <laughs>
For them to drop a case of that magnitude against you and Ruth, girl, you guys are lucky. But you see, you need to obey the conditions because the next time you reach out to them, you'll be going to jail for sure. I hurt my husband so much. I, I spoke with the lawyers and they said I have no rights over joy. It's all in the papers are signed. Hmm. I told you from the start, but you won't listen. See, babe, I know you made a lot of mistakes, okay? I know. Oh, come on. <laughs> Sorry. I have, I have made a lot of mistakes. I have took a lot of rash decisions, but it was all in the heat of the moment. But Zoe, I cannot afford to lose my husband. I know, I know. I cannot lose Jackson. I don't know. want Come to on, lose my lose. husband. It's okay. I want to lose Jack. Her, don't you? Well, if that's what you've come here to ask me, then I. I, I Jack, I... you left her in there for two weeks. I bade her out, and yet you refused to speak to her. She's barely holding up, she's barely eating. She has fallen sick several times. It's okay. Zoe, there's a thin line between love and hate. And right now, I think I have crossed that line. Wait a minute. Don't tell me you've been in support of all our atrocities. What is wrong with you? Don't ask me that. I want an answer to that question. How could you say that? Is it a yes or a no? Jack. She made a lot of mistakes. But there is no day that passes without her regretting them. You guys are made for each other. You must make this work. It's her birthday. I bet neither of you remembered, but I'm just here to let you know that it's time she moved on, and I'm here to help her with it. You were wrong, Zoe. I never forgot her birthday. Zoe, 
I don't know the occasion, but... There is no but, Maria. It's been weeks you've been in here. You just have to dress up. I uh, feel alive again. Catch some air and have fun while at it. Mm -hmm. So I already told you, I don't want to. I don't want to. Not when you talk with go water. It's almost late. Let's go so that we'll come back on time, okay? Come on, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Let's go, Joe. Come on, let's go. We'll be back very soon. Um, I'm sorry for everything. I am sorry for lying to you. I am sorry for bribing the doctor. I'm sorry. Sorry. It's okay. I, I didn't want to lose you, babe. I really miss you. I, I didn't want to lose you. That, that's why I never told you anything. That's why I kept all, I kept all the secret. I'm sorry. I know. I've died a million times trying to cope with the vacuum you left in my heart. I want to grow old with you. We can start afresh, right? Yes, yes, yes. Good. And uh, to start with. You will have to stay away from Mr. Robert and his family. Yeah. I know that child does not belong to me again. I know. Okay. Then, you will have to proceed to the advice from the doctor that we could actually try all the safe options but this time we will have to carry ourselves along every step of the way putting God first mm -hmm. and uh, I still believe in miracles you know his words say that there shall be none barren in the land. And I strongly believe that what God cannot do does not exist. What God cannot do does, does not, not exist. exist. Come on. It's somebody's birthday. Mm? So we can start doing this. <laughs> You're gonna color my lips now. <laughs> I've colored my lips, right? Um. Mm -hmm. 
this place not be fitting enough for my queen, mm -hmm. my angel. <laughs> so I will have to take you somewhere special. <laughs> but then I have to. <clears throat> hey, Zoid. Thank you so much. Thank you. You. You knew about all this. Why didn't you tell me? <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you, my friend. Thank you. And we have to do this again and again. You can do almost anything. When you crave for something so desperately You can do almost everything You will lie in the process Cheat in the process Deceive in the process To achieve it You will endanger your life And others Just to get what you want And how some people plot and plan for the selfish needs. They will get you to trust them just to carry out the evil plans. They are so desperate, ooh, so desperate. They will do anything and everything. Desperation always lead to taking the wrong action that could lead to commotion and lead to destruction. Oh. 